Can you get Lyme disease without a tick bite? The simple answer is yes. This is part of a common sense Lyme series where I address questions I see in practice all the time. I'm Dr. Daniel Cameron. Now, one of the reasons they're not detected is they're rather tiny. The nymphs can be poppy size. Uh, they can be relatively small. When you see it, you see it. There's also adult ticks that are maybe two to three times bigger. They're more visible, so you might catch them earlier. But ticks differ from dog ticks because they typically have a black shield behind its head. Uh, even the nymphs are black shield. Even if they're engorged, it's a black shield. Whereas a dog tick tends to be kind of a brown and yellow camouflage. The ticks are typically uh, not painful. They inject something into the skin. Although some people can feel it. Uh, sometimes they feel it after it's been on for a while. But many patients never go on and get a rash uh, after a tick or they never get the tick in the first place. So you have to be aware that Lyme disease is, is typically uh, more of the uh, a clinical judgment and clinical diagnosis given there's so few people that have a tick or a rash. The risk is you can have uh, all kinds of neurologic problems, uh, neuropsych problems, Lyme carditis, Lyme arthritis, etc. Now ticks can detach, so even if you think you're gonna look for ticks, often they fall off or they're scratched off and so as few as one out of five uh, children with an EM rash had uh, a tick that they knew of before the EM rash. Can other insects spread Lyme disease? Well, they can certainly find spirochetes in uh, other insects like uh, mosquitoes, but they haven't been able to show that the mosquito can carry Lyme to somebody. They just happen to be part of the blood meal. What do you do if you suspect Lyme? Well, you should uh, discuss these symptoms with the doctor, but they can be a broad range of issues. You might have flu-like symptoms at the beginning, but you might skip those maybe days, weeks, months later. That's when these uh, chronic issues develop. If you have a problem or if you think you have a problem, you should consult the doctor, even if you don't see a tick bite. 